voice keeps on calling me Down the road, that's where I'll always be Every stop I make, I make a new friend Can't stay for long, just turn around and I'm gone again Maybe tomorrow I'll wanna settle down Until tomorrow I'll just keep moving on So if you wanna join me for a while Just grab your hat, we'll travel like that's old style Maybe tomorrow I'll wanna settle down Until tomorrow I'll just keep moving on Where's it at? It's gotta be here somewhere. There it is. This is a slot? Well, the weekend seems kind of quiet, huh? Let's hope it stays that way. Come on, boy. Got the markings on it, man. Okay. Yeah, let's get out of here. Oh. This like a candy store. Come on, Charlie. I like to see the look on that dumb watchman's face when he finds out we did it to him again. Okay? Yeah. Sly? Sly? It's okay. Lightning doesn't strike twice. Now I know better. Now I've got to go call Mr. Hoffner. Come on, dog. This might be the sack for both of us. I don't understand it. I, I really don't. Twice in three weeks? Didn't you tell me we had the best guard dogs in town? Well, that's what I thought. How come? You're my chief of security. You explain it to me. Why do we spend all that money training these dogs? Sorry, Harry. I'm going to have to replace you with a younger man. I've got important government contracts to protect. Now, look, I don't think we should blame Harry. That dog should have stopped them. Sarge is the finest dog I ever worked with. You remember those four men that broke into the freight elevator? He caught them. That's ancient history. 
Look, all I know is this pair got away with almost $14,000 worth of sophisticated electronic equipment. Oh, Harry, you worked for me a long time. I'll give you one more chance, but if it happens again... Oh, it won't happen again, Mr. Hoffner. I'll see to that. Look, Harry, why don't you go home? I'll finish off the shift with Sarge. I have to wait around for the insurance people anyway, and I can drop them on the way back. Well, thanks a lot, Mr. Temple. I really appreciate that. This thing has really got me shook up. You stay with me, Sarge. Thanks, Mr. Hoffner. Right, Harry. Hi, Harry. Hi, Norma. Hi, Rosie. It's going to look nice, sweetheart. Oh, thank you. I didn't expect you home so early. Is there anything wrong, Harry? Are you all right? Oh, we had another robbery today. I just don't get it. Now, that can happen to anybody, Harry. Read the newspapers. Every day, something happens. But Rosemary, I saw them. Just two kids. Sarge should have had them. Same thing happened last time. Sarge turned chicken. Sarge, aren't you ashamed of yourself? That's not Sarge. Hey, handsome, what are you doing here? Say, he hasn't got a collar, Harry. Or a license tag. I'll bet you somebody's missing him. A good-looking animal. Mm -hmm. Well, did you see that? Smart dog. I wish you were smart enough to tell me what's wrong with Sarge. I just don't get it. I really don't understand it. There's Walt now with Sarge. Now listen, don't be too hard on that poor dog. Hello, Sarge. We got a long talk to have, don't we? Huh? We got a long talk together. For a moment there, I thought I was seeing double. <laughs> Hello, Walt. Come on, down, boy. <laughs> You're not thinking of uh, changing dogs, are you, Harry? Well, no, he's not even trained. That's just a stray I picked up. Well, I'll, I'll just leave you two alone. Come on, Sarge. Dinner. Would you like some water? No, come on, no, 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 thanks. Come on, uh, come on. Harry, even though I went to bat for you today, Hoffner suspects you may be involved in these robberies. Why'd he give me my job back? Well, it could be he's giving you enough rope to hang yourself with. And I might say you can hardly blame him. Two robberies, the same M.O., you were on duty both times, and Sarge. That dog's supposed to attack. You're supposed to be the only one able to restrain him. Well, judging from the way you talk, you think I'm in on it too, no, huh? No, 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 I know better. That's why I asked about the new dog. It might look funny, you're switching dogs in midstream. But I'm not switching. I know. I believe you. But look, the insurance company, the cops, Hoffner, they're all on my back. So try to be a little careful, will you? Yes, of course. Are you all right? Man. Yeah, I'm fine. All right. Thanks I'm gonna, for the information. I'm going to let you and Sarge take care of this whole thing. Yeah, thanks. Sarge.
What'd Walt have to say? Oh, nothing much. He just told me to be careful. You know, you don't have to keep things from me, Harry. If we've got anything to face, we can face it together. Believe me, anything that comes up, you'll be the first to know. hurts me more than it hurts you. Frame the old guy. Because our next move is a big one. I don't want any suspicion to fall on me. It's either my neck or his. I'm the only guy who knows just how big. What is it? Government stuff, top secret. Why do we have to do it tomorrow? What is this? Wimp out of the last minute oh. or something? You're backing on me I again. Cut it out. All right. Hey, you hey, hey, you guy, hey, cut it out. We gotta work together on this thing. Now, here's the whole layout. Check the diagrams. Follow it exactly. All right. Same old guy and the same dog, right? Same old guy, that's for sure. The dog I gotta check out. Huh? He had another shepherd hanging around. He said it was a stray, but I gotta make sure it's not a replacement for Sarge. Well, how are you gonna do that? Well, there's only one guy in this town who trains shepherds. If Harry's bought himself another dog, I'll know it. Chuck. Hi, Mr. Temple. Would you come out to get another dog? No, no, maybe some other time. I just want to ask you something. You don't mind waiting a few seconds? No, I'm no. just finishing up with Bo. Bo, you know what this stick is? Watch it now. Down! Down! Now, Sarah, notice. That's how it's done. No hitting of the dog. Right, Chuck. Very impressive, Chuck. Observe the value while you're at it, Temple. Bo, let's go. Jump. The dog now adhering to the stick. Bo, let's go. Jump up. Very good, Bo. OK, Bo, down. Very good. Uh, by the way, Mr. Temple, what do you want to talk to me about? Well, I was just wondering if any of my people, any of the guards, have been into buy their own personal shepherd dog. Not that I know of. Why do you ask? I'm just, just curious. That's all. That's all. Are your dog? Uh, no, no, that's, uh, it's just a stray I picked up. Do you think you could train him? Oh, I'd sure like to try. That's a big one. Good looking. Well, listen, why don't I just leave him with you? I'll call you in a couple of days. I'll have him ready for you. Thanks for coming out. Thank you, Chuck. Come here, boy. Come on, boy. Come on. Let's go. Charlie? Go as planned. The dog is safe. That's right. Like him. 
Well, look who's here. We thought you took off for good this time. No, I'm sorry, pal. See that sign? I can't let you in here. I'll see you around, huh? <coughs> sorry, boy. Sorry. <coughs> What's come over you? Here! Here! Where are you going with that? Come back with my brush! Come back with that! Here! Here! Come here! Now you shouldn't be touching those things. What are you doing? I think I better call Harry. Yes, honey. Yes, I know somebody's trying to frame me, but who? And what does he have to gain? All right. Yeah, well, I'll talk to you later, sweetheart. I have to take a look around. Okay? See you later. Bye. I still don't see why I need to frame the old man. Okay, look. You climb the fence, all right? I'm going to use these keys the temple gave us. Got them for the office. We can use them for the gate. Sly, what's the difference, you know? You're right. So the old fool gets busted. Come on, Sarge. We've got a little work to do. Come on, boy. Which office did he say? There's nothing here. you think, man? Because... Money in the bank. We got company, man. Shh. It's the dog, man, but I don't think it's the watchman's. How do you know? I don't know. There's no collar or nothing on it. Let's see if we can trap him, okay? Take this, man. Ready? Secure. Hey, hold it. Hold it there. It's the guy again. Now let's go. Go get him, Sarge. <laughs> Hey! 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 Hey!
handwriting looks familiar. Walter Temple. <coughs> Listen, boys. Don't give Sarge a reason to go in after you now. He's itching to do just that. It was all Temple's idea. He, he said he'd make us rich. Here, here, take it. I don't even know what it is. Did a real nice job, friend. A real nice job. <laughs> Hello, oh, sweetheart. Are you all right? Never felt better in my life. You know what? I wish you'd give up this job. Well, okay, but uh, <laughs> you'll be getting rid of the new chief of security. What? That's right. Harry! After the boys turned on Walt Temple, Mr. Hoffner needed a new chief of security, and there I was. <laughs> of course, it's going to mean uh, a little more money, a little less walking, but I'll give it up if that's what you want. I'm beginning to have second thoughts yeah. on the subject. <laughs> I've even devised a new plan. What? Sarge and his new friend are going to do all the patrolling. Oh, you know, that new dog is smart enough. Yes. Hey, friend? Friend? Well, I wonder where he went. There's a voice that keeps on calling me down the road that's where i'll always be every stop i make i make a new friend can't stay for long just turn around and i'm gone again maybe tomorrow i want to settle down until tomorrow i'll just keep moving on driving too fast. It cost my wife's life and it put Chris into a wheelchair. Slow down! Chris! Watch out for the highway! So if you want to join me Until tomorrow, the whole world is my home. 